it's loud. Today I'm gonna tell you about my weekend. Coming up tomorrow, my best friend's getting married. And I'm gonna be in the wedding and I have to do a speech. And I thought I would give you guys a sneak preview of my speech, but because I don't wanna spoiler it, before the wedding, I thought instead what I would do is I would just give you guys the portions that I've cut out uh, so there won't be any spoilers. So here we go. Here is the portions that I have cut from my best friend's wedding speech to her and her husband. Penises, you guys, are weird. Have you ever felt a 10 volt electrical current? Until I realized that serial killers are almost never Asian. It's just me and her and these two guys. Auschwitz, you guys, food for thought. If I couldn't be gay for Candace, I am definitely straight. I brought my dog. Take that, all you effing people with babies. And that is page 255 of my biography. Okay. How is this girl single? And we hid the body in a dumpster in Nevada. I'm gonna start by singing 16 bars of On My Own, and then I'm gonna do a monologue from the best little whorehouse in Texas. And that's when I knew that it was going to be true love. I've just never had my hair done by anyone so adept. In our drunken slutty years, they never could locate the weapon, so we were never convicted. But I like to think of that as a something that really connects us. Okay, that's it. I'll let you guys know how the wedding was on Monday. I'll talk to you guys soon. Mwah, 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 mwah. Wish Candace and Ken many, many years of happiness. Love you guys. Bye. See you on Monday for Everyday May.